Today we're going to Central Medellin. I'll tell you, there's some beautiful women down there. Wow, I know Colombia has them. Oh, what's going on here? Daddy Longleg is over here. Miss Longleg, let's take a second look at this. Oh my goodness. <clears throat> Looks like uh, somebody's been working out. And uh, I think she's going to give him a grand tour. <laughs> she said like 50 meals, so maybe it's a tour. I don't know what they're doing up there. So guys, keep in mind that everyone down here is not escort. There's a lot of people just come down here to enjoy the park and enjoy the art. Families come down here too. And you'll see a lot of girls are just working, like cooking and selling and, and selling clothes. And so it's a great place to meet some girls that may be just working and you know selling something. That's a great thing to do. You also see some cool little break dancers and give them a little tip. One, two, five meal, whatever. It goes a long way here and just you know, good vibes, man. They attract, trust me. Oh my goodness. So this girl almost ran into me. She literally ran into me almost. I was like, whoa, I didn't see. Look how beautiful she is. She is like a model. Back in the United States, she'd be like a model. So uh we go over here checking this place out. I turned the corner and just wow, check this out. So I try to play it off like I'm gonna get some gum here. I mean, they have just a ton of women on this block for, I think, like two blocks, maybe, yeah, two city blocks, just nothing for women to pick. And, you know, they're asking 30, 40, 50 mil for a session. You know, even for an hour, I think someone said 80 mil. Look at these two right here. Now, I don't know if you noticed that, but she has on, I don't know, hold on, she has a little thong on it. Look at this. She's so beautiful. I had to reverse this one for you guys. Take a close look at her outfit. <laughs> like uh, she has her little bikini on. So let's take another look here. Ah, she is a beautiful young girl. Look at this. She looks like about 20 years old. Come on, like her video. Look at this. All right, let's take a look here. Hopefully, you give us a like and thumbs up and all that good stuff. Check a look here. Just amazing. Their bodies. I, I love these type of bodies. If you like little ladies, this is not the place. This is their more thicker here. So like I said, there's some just regular girls on here and you know, great place to introduce yourself, smell good, look good, feel good, and you'll stand out, you know? Right now I'm just, I'm undercover, so you know, nobody really wants to talk to me. I'm just wearing a hat looking like, you know, just a regular dude. But if you want to meet someone, just come down here and you know, look. Now these girls are, you know, they're working girls. So this is probably not the ones you have to impress, just impress with the green. Uh, <laughs> And this is very close to Bot uh, Boteo uh, Park or Museo or whatever, where all the statues are at. And uh, they're all right there. They have some uh, little rooms to the right. Uh, rooms are like 10 mil right, right up there. See, right up there. And I'm going to give you a second look. So they, all these rooms up there, they look scary to me, but you know, there's a lot of guys going up there, no problems. And, you know, there's like 10 mil for the room for 30 minutes and do whatever you got to do and get up out of there. And just another, just another selection of girls just, you know, out here shopping or working, just regular girls working at a shoe store. So a great place for you to say, hey, how you doing? I'm so-and-so. Now, we're going to a bar here, walking around the bar section. Now, still by Boteo Park or Museo, whatever you want to call that. People getting drunk and working. This is a beautiful woman we've seen. And she was just walking. We don't know if she's a working girl or not. And she looks kind of elegant, but she just never tell. She's beautiful. And uh, Fedrick's asking her a couple of questions. Now, we are going to the working red lights district. Remember, all this is completely right legal that. here. So, this is, uh, they're just out here working, you know, trying to make them out. Working girls. And this is another one there. She's standing by the room, so we just go up the room. Get a massage or any kind of extra perks you can, that you can imagine. This is my kind of woman here. She is just my dream girl. She looks like she's with her husband or boyfriend or something. Gives me hope because he looks like he's about. You know, 60, 70 years old. This girl tries to pick me up, but she's uh, not my type at all. Plus, she is, you know, she's pretty, but just not my cup of tea. I don't like anything like that. So we're walking around. Those two look beautiful. She got the Marilyn Monroe outfit going on up there. This one is cute. Uh, kind of thick, nice, pretty face, colored eyes. Let's take a second look at those. I mean, she's very beautiful. Wow. 
I mean, some of these girls just are amazing. There goes my dream wife right there. No, not oh, right now. Look at that body. Oh, man. Yeah, it's just built like a brick house there. And hey, you know, that's my cup of tea. I got. I, I took a bunch of videos of her. <laughs> Gives me a lot of hope. Look at this guy. He's like at least 65. Okay, so we're back in the red light district over there. They're just out here looking for customers, looking for Johns. And uh, let me... There goes this girl. She just spots me, but I don't say anything. She just looks at me, and so she comes back. I guess she, she noticed me. I'm just getting video. She comes, tells me, and she's like, oh, it's 30 mil, which is like $9. Plus the room is like another color. Okay, this place. This place. So like, I don't know, 10 or 12 dollars for the whole thing. It's ridiculous. Beautiful girl. Do you get a second? Nice uh, legs, which I like, but you know, to me, uh, just I wasn't feeling it, so I was like, hey. Hola. Okay, yeah, she's thirty. Okay, let's go. So, anyways, we're gonna go check it out. Go down the street. Uh, found these two, kind of two lesbians, or one is for sure, uh, which is cool. No problem. Hey, float your boat, whatever makes you happy. Uh, I actually thought I was gonna say hi to her. This one's very pretty on this phone. Wow, another one, another one behind this pole. Too thin right for there, me too. though. And there was a ton of police out here There's for some reason. I don't know why. This girl doesn't look like she's working, but she said hi to me. I was like, hey, hola, como estas? She says hi. <laughs> and so I don't, you know, just another, like I said, just look good and feel good. Look, once again, I'm gonna play slow motion here. I just go up. She doesn't have it to say hi. Hi, I say hola. She says hi. Come on, stars. And then she says, How are you doing? So, you know, I had my opportunity and I, you know, I lost it. And that was a good place to meet someone. God dang it, Alan. And here we are in the red lights uh, district one more time. Looks like someone gave them some money and they're happy. At least they have a good attitude. Behind there is a bar that has rooms uh, for rent, like 10 mil for an hour, a half hour, or something. There goes a young lady again. Now we went underneath the freeway and they got a big store, they got a lot of stores with fake clothes. I shouldn't say fake, I mean like replica Nikes and all that good stuff. And as the rain's coming down, I'm back at the red light district. It started to rain now, so it's going down, so I gotta be careful. And I did this video over two days actually, to be honest. Yeah, I did this video over two days because it was raining real bad and I was like, I'm gonna have to come back out when people are regular. So, there's this girl that's just so pretty. I don't know if you can see her. She had that red jacket on. I try to catch up with her. Just really beautiful. So look at this one. Oh wow! And there's some two regular girls. Now these are women just working. Look like they're buying stuff and selling them. And you could buy stuff wholesale here and then sell it back in another little pueblo, a little town. Here I'm hiding my glasses. See a couple of working girls. Uh, I mean, work in the red light district. Uh, we are in the red light district here. They got those rooms. That's the rooms right there, right up there. Exactly. And right here it says, right, there's some veteran uh, red light workers, some thickums. Hey, you never know. Some guys. And then, yeah, there's another girl here, just regular worker, got off work. Look tired as I wasn't going to mess with her, but she is uh, stacked like I like. I was like, wow, she's pretty. Uh, now I'm headed back to the car right here. I parked my car in this parking lot over here. It's really safe. I mean, it's super safe, super security. I mean, they got dogs and all kinds of stuff. Walking back, so I hope you guys, you know, enjoyed this video. Hit the thumbs up if you can. If you thought that it's worthwhile, you, you know, you had some fun and entertainment, maybe learned a couple of tips. Look at this beautiful woman here. She is so pretty. Reverse that one. Look at that. She is, she's gorgeous. Like some of these girls can really be models back in the United States. Just like they need their opportunity. Wow. Back in the red light district here and it's raining. Ugh. Can't really, I'm getting footage off of my GoPro. So enjoy. I'm gonna just sit back and chill.
Hey guys, thanks so much for watching our video here on YouTube or ColumbiaTips.com. Our goal here is to educate the world about how beautiful it is here in Colombia, how economical and how safe it is. We have a bad rep from the 80s and 90s that just has not left our loving Colombia. So we want to paint a different picture, but I need your help. I need you to smash that like button and if possible, even comment below. Let us know what you th what did you think about this video and where would you like us to review next? Where would you like to us to go next in our next video? Engage, engage, engage. And the reason why is as the more engagement the video gets, the higher it gets in the ranking of YouTube. So do us a big favor. I need your help, guys. We need to get these tourism fired back up for our mom and pop shops here in Colombia. I see you guys on the next one. Peace and love. I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.